welcome back to another uh, Spells Can Bake video. Um, today we're going to be doing um, mystery ingredients baking. So I've got all these ingredients in a bowl and I'm going to pick out, um, is it 10 or 9? Uh, I'm sorry about that um, ingredient and I'll see what I can make with it. So first ingredient, butter, that's a good start. Brown sugar, pretty good. Tinned pineapple, already think of something. Free choice, I'll choose what I want to do later. Eggs. Oh. Pickles. Okay. Three more things, I think. What's this one? Stuff raising flour, pretty good. Baking powder. And cast So um, I'm just gonna go and get all the ingredients and hold and and try and hunt the internet for recipes and um, I'll tell you when I've got some. Um, so I've got my caster sugar uh, here. I've got my butter here, a big block of butter. I've got my tinned pineapple, lots of rings over there. I've got my brown sugar. This is the thing. Some baking powder, <coughs> stuff raising flour, and my two pickles. <laughs> I actually love pickles, but not in a cake or whatever I'm making. And for my free choice, I decided to go with glacé cherries because I think it'll go well in, in the making. So I've got my um, softened butter, and I've got my 50 grams of each of. So brown sugar, 50 grams, and salt and butter, 50 grams. And I'm just going to get to my bowl. And I'm just going to pour this thing. Ooh, I'm going to pour my oops, oops, brown sugar in there. And I'm going to mix them up until they, it looks like a kind of grainy sludge. What I'm going to do. Yeah, so you can probably see what I'm talking about, the grainy sludge. Yes, yeah, so we're just gonna. I'm just gonna get my uh, like cake tin. I'm just gonna use my spatula. So just so get it off from the side and just pop it down there. And you're just gonna spread spread the mixture all over the bottom of the cake and up around a quarter of the sides. So. Once you've done that and it looks a bit like this, it will take a while, but you'll get there in the end. So I'm just going to take my pineapple ring and you want to put them around the edge just with like a fork or a spoon, whatever you have. Just put them around the edge and then see if you can squeeze one in the middle. Don't worry. Just, you can just like in, in, in. You know, you, you might not know them, but like there's these beads that if you iron them, they go, they all glue together and you can make patterns with them. You just want to make the kind of star that you, you might not know it, but so if you just squish them in there, squish, 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 all right, and then you want to take them, don't, don't do it for a little, please. Hmm. And you want to take your glass of cherries. You just want to put one of these into the middle of your things. If your cherries are quite small, you could probably get one and maybe a half. Because we want extra cherries. Because they're very nice. <laughs> squish. 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 Squish, 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 squish. Right. So once you've done that, we're going to start making our cake. Back.
butter. That's so you'll need 100 grams of self-raising gram of the caster sugar and 100 grams of salt. And once you've got all of those ingredients into a bowl like this, and you want to take um, another whisk, not the same one, the must being cleaned, and you just want to mix it. Oh, it's hard. And you just want to mix it until it's all combined. Once your mixture looks a, a little bit like this, and just like a bit like a kind of dough sort of, you want to add uh, one teaspoon of um, baking powder, two eggs that I've forgotten to bring up. So I'll go and get those, and then I'll put them in. Two eggs. So I'm just gonna crack them in. Oh, don't be, don't be shy, please, don't be shy, don't be shy. Mm -hmm. I always find it so satisfying when eggs go into the bowl. Alright, and so if you're making this at home, it would be better to add um, to a uh, one teaspoon of uh, vanilla extract, but <laughs> since I'm not allowed to, um, I'm just going to, it won't do anything really, just add the flavour. If you've got any of the, the like the pineapple syrup that the pineapple syrup in you can add that as well but if you don't it's it's not really essential so i'm just going to mix all of these in oh there's two eggs by the way yeah yeah it. yeah two eggs and i'm just going to mix all this in until it looks like a cake batter so if you're making this at home please please just do not add pickle but since the rule tells me to i have to so that is what chopped up pickle looks like I'm so sad to be ruining this dish, but I have to. Goodbye. I'm just going to mix it in and hope I can never taste the pickle. After that truly sad moment, we have one of this guy, this cake man. Yep, him. We're going to use our spatula to put the cake mixture over the pineapple. And then you want to spread it out. Just try not to get the cherries in it because they will just be annoying. <laughs> and you want them to look nice on the surface. I really hope the pickles don't do anything. Or if they do, make it nicer. Maybe I'll discover a new thing that actually pickles taste lovely in cakes. Not very likely to be honest. So I'm just gonna pop this in the oven to bake um, for but around 25 minutes, depending on if um, if you've used like a smaller cake pit tan, it, cake pan, <laughs> yep, and you just put it higher up, that'll be fine. But you just need to bake it for longer. But if you have made a bigger one like me, and you've made it like spread out a bit more, it will it'll probably be 25. So just put this in the oven, and I'll show you where it's done. So once you've taken your cake out of the oven, and um, it should just look a bit like this. Um, Bit lighter depending on how you like it and you're just gonna if you have like a cake tin like this and you've got like a side thing you want to do so when you take it out of the oven you want to like let it kind of rest for a couple of minutes and then you'll want to take a plate and very very carefully flip it over right two I just want to And you'll see something a bit like this. Not so much to happen. Um, yeah, so hopefully you like it and yeah.